Good morning, everyone. I'm Martin Kaminsky. I'm the president and CEO of Interfaith Ministries for Greater Houston, which hosts uh, volunteer Houston and many service projects to get the community involved in the work of the community and helping us get unified. And nothing can unify us more than art and service and youth and corporate supporters. And today, we're here to honor all of those constituencies and to say thank you to them and to leave a lasting tribute for the youth in this Boys and Girls Clubs that can always remember that everybody can be great because anybody can serve. So thank you for being here and thanks to all those who helped paint portions of this mural that have come together with the great artistry uh, of our creator today. Thank you. Thank you, Martin. Uh, Volunteer Houston is proud to be a program of the Interfaith Ministries. When the transition happened in 2017, our mission didn't change. We still exist to connect local individuals and groups and companies with local nonprofits and schools, government offices, and other volunteer initiatives. We do that primarily through our web-based portal, but because we are local, we're able to offer additional programs, services, trainings, and projects like this one, our very first annual MLK Mural Project. It was important to us while we were developing this project that we stayed true to Dr. King's vision of a beloved community. Uh, and we accomplished that by embracing three local components. The first was identifying four local nonprofits to receive a completed mural, like Boys and Girls Club. The second was enlisting the creative expertise of a local muralist, David Cobb. And the third was relying on local companies, employees, and individual participants who did their part in painting a 12 by 12 canvas of the larger murals. Um, when you step back from the mural, we received Dr. King's message of service to others and equality to all. But when you step in close, you begin to see the differences in the 168 individuals who painted their piece in the larger mural. It's a true representation of community. We could not have done this without the dedication of all of our supporters, um, sponsors, and participants. So a huge thank you to all of you all. And um, we could have done it without the efforts of our program manager, Gayla Wilson. Good morning, everyone. The Martin Luther King Day of Service Project for Volunteer Houston began in fall 2021. And when we came up with this idea, we wanted something that could create an opportunity to combine the social impact of art as well as with the community and the idea around the inequities that create so many of our communities. So we wanted something that could bridge the community together to hopefully erase the divide, to bring people together to understand that art is a communicator, art is a bridge to diversity and inequity. And so if I think about the Boys and Girls Club, the three quotes that on this mural connect Dr. King's vision of a beloved community, service, fighting injustice, and never giving up. And the Boys and Girls Club of Greater Houston works every day through their programming to inspire the young club members who participate in their program. They feel as though that workforce readiness the understanding of education being the opportunity to a future, all play a part together in creating young adults and developing young adults to be their best future possible. And so we know that this mural will continue to be a reminder to the club members that education, that inequity, that fairness, that community, and that volunteerism all play a role in making sure that each and every person has a role in contributing to the beloved community. We are honored to present this mural to the Boys and, Club, Boys and Girls Club of Greater Houston. And we want to thank our corporate sponsors, Bridgeway Capital Management, the Home Depot Foundation, Chenier Energy, Reliant and NRG Company, and Holloway Environmental and Communication, as well as community participants who all came together to create the panels that, that will combine the idea of art, injustice, fairness, service, volunteerism, and perseverance. So with that being said, I'd like to present Kevin Hattery, CEO of Boys and Girls Club of Greater Houston, with not only the MLK mural, but also this commemorative placard that will serve as a reminder 
of the purpose of the project and how it brought our community together in, uh, in service and in art. Thanks, Kevin. Thank you very much, Kayla. Um, good morning, everyone. My name is uh, Kevin Hatter. I'm the CEO of uh, Boys and Girls Club Greater Houston. It's a pleasure to have you here today. Um, this beautiful mural is, is really a reminder of the struggles that our country has faced in the past, that we're facing today, that we'll be facing in, in the future. And it's also a reminder of the advancements that we have made as well. When you think about Dr. Martin Luther King and the, uh, the Civil Rights Movement, it takes all of us, and Boys and Girls Club is, is an example of creating a movement in order to uh, create great futures that, that start here. That can only happen because of the collaborative partnerships that uh, we take with utmost important. And so working with Volunteer Houston, Interfaith Ministries, and all the many corporate partners that helped create this, it's a reminder to our staff, it's a reminder to the young people who are going to walk in here every day and say, going into the future, we have to continue to make advancements. So our programming around social justice